Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. I'm setting up for the Gear 360 take. I'm recording in HD 1080p 60 frames per second for audio with the Rode Video Micro using a E 4K action camera. There's a lot of noise, and I'm shooting with the Gear 360 2017 at 4K at 24 frames per second. I'm going to be editing the video or videos chapters at 8.5 minutes per in Action Director that may take a good plus hour per chapter. And then I'm going to be using Power Director 15 Ultimate to add title, to add the soundtrack, and the 4K video and edit and render and load up to Facebook along to YouTube at the groups and share my experience and fun to the world. I have used five, five fingers of death, I call this. My first Samsung Gear 360 2017 at home, taken apart. Only test I didn't run was with the open case to see how long the camera will work in summertime. This is my second Gear 360 2017 purchase off of eBay at another $85 price. I do apologize for the shakiness and all. I had it sent down. I had a good time using it, but it overheated in under 15 minutes, one chapter's length. Six minutes to be exact. I decided to contact the seller, put a dispute in, and I will pull the dispute because it's not his fault. I thought I'd just go to Best Buy and buy a brand new one. That's my third one. It felt like it was uh, open because this sticker had no glue on it. When I finished testing the two, one shut off earlier than the other. I returned the Best Buy back to Best Buy, along with the Samsung Evo Select Plus card I purchased for $40, 128 meg, 90 meg write speed card. Was no need for me to have the card at the given time. A 64 gig card would have been good enough. This doesn't use great file sizes, trust me. I thought I'd go get a fourth one. And sure enough, that fourth one is probably this one I'm using at the moment. So I do apologize if I can't count past four. I am on number four, number five. It makes no difference what number of the Samsung Gear 360 2017 I'm on because I know there's not going to be a perfect working model on the market. I believe you got the perfect working model on the market. Samsung and people out there, and I will say this, and when I get an opportunity to go and see some of these YouTube vloggers, if I ever bump into the person, or if I could find uh, that particular episode, 
they have the Samsung product and they're going out there and using it. Never did they say if they tested out this camera. It was working 100%. Think hard about that one. I try to keep open and honest about everything. I have no need to lie to you. Four K at twenty four frames per second does its job quite well. I'm very pleased with it. I'm very pleased I get a chapter's worth that I can share the fun. I feel not many people are gonna sit here and watch my videos for hours on end. So as long as I can share a small moment with the world, these are my notes. And these notes may help somebody out down the road. I fail 360 video is still coming out for the future and being worked on. Power Director 15 Ultimate, not easy to use for 360 editing. It is 16. It's going to have added features and functions. 17, 18. By the time they get up to Power Director 20, they're going to have this perfected. And maybe five years down this road, there'd be better 360 cameras to have. This is a perfect camera right now. Shooting 2K7 at 60 frames per second until the 1160 MAH battery depletes out. Do your time lapses, the HDR videos. There's no complaints at all there. When's the best time to do a 360 video? Not when that sun is coming up, shining in your eyes, forcing the camera to struggle. People say, take that selfie stick, raise it like so. Let me tilt my camera out on this particular angle. And you may not see my selfie stick at all. So in this software of the camera, there's going to be automatic self-writing. So when I'm walking in this particular straight line, you'll get that 360 spherical degree all around. I prefer to see the selfie stick in the video so you know I'm the main primary start point. If you could do picture in picture, I'm not going to stick a picture in up here because I'm going to tell you at 7 o'clock, look at this picture. If I can remember right, look at 2 o'clock position where the sun is at. I'll take a picture of the Everglades and I'll post it in of where I just walked. If my phone could take a picture I would do that and it can't. There it goes. I do apologize while I'm getting over my cold. I do apologize as the noise gets closer and closer. My glasses, I need to read how much time is on the board so I can tell you how long this video for me is. 
I'm just shy under 10 minutes. 10 minutes to the time. That's just two chapters. I'm about to have the longest video on YouTube in 4K at 24 frames per second. Woohoo! I ain't gonna jump and have something fall out like my camera and break or drop the 360. I want to get a case for my 360. The silicone case and cover. It'll be a perfect protecting device, but it may hurt the overheating issue. Like a cell phone. The camera will struggle to work correctly. So when the camera feels it's overheating, I'm going to rest, shut down, and work later on. I'm running earliest firmware known as the last two digits, Season Charlie 6. I know there was another firmware, I think it was uh, D or E. But the last one prior to my upload was F. I think they're up to K, K2. I got spider webs all over me. With C6 and the latest 1.5, whatever, 104, Jackrabbit. Did you just see the Jackrabbit cross? Back up and look. With the latest app for Android or this is my channel, what I use, Apple iOS device, my latest firmware. I cannot live stream at all. I need to update the existing firmware to live stream with these two cameras. My earlier camera with K2 and 1.5 104 will not show live feed. In preview of the camera and preview of live stream to Facebook or YouTube. With YouTube you are forced to close the app. With Facebook, you can back out. This is Samsung, I want to say. But I think the phone and the camera, there is an issue that the camera had issues. Ladies and gentlemen, a very good part of this video is look to the 10 o'clock position. You see this bird taking in the sun and a crane. We have cranes up north. We also have these birds that go in the water and their cranes flying 9 o'clock. Uh, will I go down to show you? Yes, I'll go down nice and quiet. I'm sorry that I'm yelling, is to get over the noise. <coughs> so how long am I into this video? With the longest video on the market. There he goes, it can't get any closer than that. Now the other two that flew, they were small. He was big when he was up close. We may be able to see him when we uh, get out of here, but uh, let's see if we can get up to this bird nice and close. I'll be nice and quiet. I'll walk nice and slow. And he's just about uh, going to get ready to fly because he sees me.
he knows he's protected because the uh, water's there, but he'll still fly away. That's a crow that you hear. And I don't want to get any closer than this to the water for my protection. I got my GoPro. I could dunk it. No need to. As I slowly turn away, I'm heading on out. So, ladies and gentlemen, how long of a walk? And this camera running. Spider web on the pole. I'm 15 plus minutes in. Closing at 16. One of the things I didn't do. Weather. It should be nice today. Up to 82 degrees. What is it right now? 68 degrees. 68 degrees. So, we are... Let me do that for you again. Weather. It should be nice today. Oh. I will post this video, photo, of the weather. So you get the idea exactly how hot it was. Now these two chapters, the longest video, is going to be so difficult. It's going to take me eight hours to get this clip up. Is it worth eight hours to do a video? Are you happy with two chapters? Hell yeah! There goes the heron. He's flying. Two chapters, man. I'm happy. I'm very pleased. Should I update? Ooh, that's the question. I want a live stream. I really want a live stream. And if I update and it kills the camera, that's going to be my fault. And Samsung's going to be laughing. Cabin in the Woods. You ever see that movie? Cabin in the Woods. Where they're all hanging down below. And they take bets on everything. That's what this is about. Cabin in the Woods, man. I'm going to hop in the car. And I'm going to basically continue the review. Ah, a lot of people come out here to fish. I bring my fishing pole. They're probably catching gar. We got gar back home. Razor sharp, pinpoint, needle nose fish. Uh, they're clear bodies. Uh, gar is an alligator fish over here. It looks exactly like a little alligator. And it's very edible to some. <coughs> Look to your left and right. You got water coming out of your right. I'll put my GoPro in the water over here underneath maybe you see some fish who knows we'll go over here where it says uh, do not enter right. you got lily pads there that's what I want to show you I'm just going to try to get towards the uh, the edge just to point out this is a good spot for uh, RC hobby man I'm going strong on here I gotta look at the time again maybe I'll block the Sun give you the best shot of the camera right should have cleaned my lens I apologize for that 
Guys, I got the longest video playing. 20 minutes. 20 minutes. How's this for a beautiful shot? Let me just get right here, block that sun for you. Lily pads, birds on the little mound of dirt, Aussie hobby, bring your car here, climb up, do a little couple of jumps. Oh yeah. If I'm in the car, that means I could turn the air conditioner on, make this run longer. Anybody uh, ask me, can you feel the camera, see how hot it is? The camera is not hot. It is not hot. Having shut and turned the camera off is not going to affect the run time. Not at all. So my test is really completed. I'm finished. I'm going to head out. I'm going to continue on and say thank you very much for viewing this wonderful video. Am I going to go to another park and do a walk and talk? I feel sorry for the little kid. I really do. It's, it's goofy, man. Goofy, you want to come with me? Yeah, I'll go with you. How was that 360 walk? It was great. I feel sorry for the little kid that lost his toy. Now, I'm going to lower my stick down some so I can get into the car. Sorry for the angling and all. And it is a little cooler in my car. So guys, gals, is that fair? Sure it is. It's fair indeed. You know the vents are right here. And I am going to turn the air off. And... The actual temperature is 71 degrees. Can you see it? Can you see right here? 71 degrees. And I feel that if I ride like this, I should have kept the uh, the thing like this. See if I put my seatbelt on and I continue on. I won't uh, go all the way home with it, that's for sure. <laughs> but you get to see the ride now. I wish I had a bicycle. I would have ridden all the way in there. <coughs> it's a short walk and talk. I've uh, de definitely been out here for a full hour. Not with the Gear 360, but with uh, my GoPro Hero 5 Black Session. I say Black Session because I love the camera. Uh, no issues with it. Uh, they say Quick Capture has issues. <coughs> Again, let me just uh, reiterate, recap a little. I have in my pocket e 4K just for sound. I have to uh, sync the video together in Action Director, no, Power Director 15 Ultimate. 
I want to update so badly. I may just pay the extra couple of dollars versus waiting for Christmas time because they got a sale going on to the 15th. I may wait till I get home because I may want to uh, do that load back home. Uh, this is uh, Sawgrass uh, Expressway. It's a toll road. It's going to cost you to get on and off. And it can run up to, I say, $10 from start to finish. It's a fairly new road. And it gets you to the turnpike. And we take it when we travel uh, to and from our uh, journey. And does a lot of uh, cut off rather going local. We do take it going to different areas, but we try to avoid the toll and take the local roads and other roads. Uh, this reminds me of like uh, South Carolina, no, South California. Uh, a lot of roads are open 40 plus, 50 plus miles per hour on the side streets. We're uh, 25 minutes in. Wow, man. That is amazing. I'm in no rush. I can get over into my right lane. And I cannot cut in and out to go where I need to go. There are no shortcuts. But this will give you an idea of what the area looks like and the houses looks like. If you've never been to Florida, guys, gals, Hurricane Irma has hit. And it basically a lot of wind and uh, water, no, not no flooding, just a lot of wind and a lot of tree landscape damage. I can't go straight because there's no outlet, but there are a couple of houses here for sale. I uh, will get back onto the main road again because there's no, uh, you know, crossroads to cut. Look how pretty this is. If you work, you need to travel. It's very close to get to where you need. Shopping is very accessible. It's a very quiet road. Not much traveled on. It's got a beautiful front yard. Halloween is over. And Thanksgiving's over. Christmas here. And nighttime, a couple of houses are decorated. Some swimming pools, all that good stuff. Very short front, much bigger than the front house I got back home. And I'd be happy living here. The RC truck there and all. Eh, look at that Halloween. I said Halloween. Look at that Christmas decoration. The water's towards my uh, right. It's an outlet. I can't go. So I got to get back onto the main road. Now there is another cutoff that I can take can't turn down this block no outlet why'd you turn down that road to show you how beautiful it is I'm back on the main drag strip many places to walk I am happy guys excited so what has happened last night who knows does that mean do I sit in the house and do another test for you? And see how long it runs? <laughs> oh man. I guess the camera's shy. I don't want to be on TV. <laughs> see the road up ahead called Riverside Drive? That's where we're going to end back up on. I don't know if I could go straight, but we'll give a shot. I was supposed to turn. Let's see what happens if I go straight. I didn't do many ride videos uh, this time around, showing you different places. I don't know if I could go straight, but we'll try one more. Because the canal is over there. And it says no outlet towards my right. Dead end. So I think these two roads that I'm making my left on, they're going to circle back in. 
And I found out uh, yesterday when I went to find the Everglades. So I was told about, go walk in the Everglades. It's a beautiful place. A lot of people walk there. That's nice. Nice mailbox. Can't hit that and knock it down. Old house. I wouldn't mind uh, knocking the wall down that they had there and, and redoing it over to look something like this. They always got a lot of ducks. Ugly ducklings, man. We came from uh, the left-hand side. So this is the way out. School's in progress and it's going to be 15 miles per hour. Sorry for the sun being in your eyes, guys. Start to look towards the uh, right-hand side so you can see the... Uh, the canal we're trying to pass. <coughs> Yesterday, a guy, he was going about 40 miles per hour. He didn't slow down until everybody was uh, on top of him. He saw the taillights. And you got to respect uh, the kids in the school. And these school guards really should be with the uh, pen and paper taking down license plates of the people that don't slow down. They know who are going fast. They can write them down and say, hey, go check this guy out. He should be there with the remote control video camera so he can snap the shot, the guy speeding through, and then uh, send it in. But they're not police officers, so they can't do that. So if you want to avoid a 15-mile-per-hour speed limit, you really can't. Uh, there are many schools out here. Some of them are maybe 10 miles per hour. Back home, uh, it's, uh, I think, 20, and they got speed light cameras. That's what you don't want, because those cameras run 24-7. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, that's official. We're shut off. Add up the time. I want to thank you very much for joining me. Uh, this camera works great outdoors and definitely got the longest video on the market today. Thank you very much for joining me and we'll be out of here running other tests. Have a great day.
in some credits if I can. It looks like my battery ran dry. Woo! Baby, am I happy?